I love doing research, but some of the best tips I've gotten have been from other mamas. Now, momming is my favorite topic, and I want to share what I know. Born in the rock and the shoe, shy, shy, shy. My therapist was like one of my first calls after yeah. I came home and had my baby because I was like, I'm so woke to postpartum as a yes. thing. She was like, are you having thoughts of suicide? No. Are you having thoughts of like when he cries, you don't want to get up and feed him? And I'm like, no. I'm already prone to anxiety and depression. I left myself notes on my mirror. This is temporary. You were experiencing postpartum. I was like, be prepared. Take the steps that's gonna that's gonna get you the best solution, that's gonna make you the healthiest. Yes. I personally believe that like all of our self-esteem comes from responsibility and like accomplishing your responsibility. So I get a lot of self-esteem from being a good responsible mom and then still take time for like a necessary Yourself. separateness. Yes. Yeah. I am going to need a lot of help with that. I will help you Please. because I don't have time for guilt. I'm not interested in it. It's a useless emotion. You can acknowledge Who that you Who is feel this guilty. person? Guilt is wasted energy. So is shame, so is regret. It's all wasted energy. And that's energy you could be putting into having a good time with your kid. Is everybody hearing this? Guys. I'm wrapping it up nicely for you. Weirdly enough, because it is so different, that's why it's fun to talk about. I came home and I was, I felt high as a kite for like three months. I would sit and nurse the baby and be in the living room and just be like, <laughs> just no. giggle to myself. It was so weird. How great is I know, that it though? It was wonderful. But I did not expect that experience. Right. I was incredibly grateful for it. But a lot of women don't have it. And I think. I had this. It was up like, oh my God. I, I was crazy. Each week, like he's almost five weeks now, and I'm just starting again. Like we just went out on a date on Saturday night mm -hmm. and I had my first hard liquor that I've had in 10 months. I had three sips and I was like, this is the greatest night of my entire life. Like I have my son here who's so beautiful and my husband who's so beautiful and this delicious Japanese whiskey that's so beautiful. And it was like <laughs> great. And I could start to see into my future as yeah. like a mom who boozes. No, I'm kidding. As a, like I could just see into my future as like, Oh, like I'm gonna find myself and yeah. I'm gonna find my way. It takes a minute. Do you wanna feel how big my jaw muscle is from talking so much? This is not a <laughs> <laughs> What? Kristen, <laughs> are you kidding me?